When I tweeted who the keynote speaker was for the Ottawa International Games Conference, my Twitter blew up. Howard, you have a lot of fans out there on the internet. Howard Scott Warshaw, everybody, the creator of Yars Revenge, Indiana Jones for the Atari 2600, and notoriously, E.T. the Extraterrestrial, which I am not ashamed. I played a whole lot of as a kid. I was obsessed with E.T. You said in your talk, you don't see that as a failure. You see that as a success, correct? Absolutely. Absolutely. There's, there's, there's nothing that registers failure about E.T. for me. What it was, was it was a game that was sort of jammed into a crazy time in the dawning of the games industry. And when they had a license for E.T., it didn't matter how much time there was, a game had to come out. And I was the only person in development who was willing to take the chance to try and do a game in five weeks when no one had ever done a game in less than five or six months. So I did it. I got the thing done. It was like 8K of original code. And I climbed a mountain. And it's been very gratifying to me. Also, for the people who say it's the worst game of all time, here's what I got to tell you. I don't really believe it's the worst game of all time, but I really prefer it when people do identify it as the worst game of all time, because I did Yars Revenge, which is one of the best games of all time. So now I have the greatest range of any game designer in history.